Hello, kids. How are you? I hope you are happy and healthy. You see, being happy and healthy is very important for us. It gives us the will and ability to do everyday tasks like reading, writing, and even having fun. But there are times when we are not healthy, like when we catch a cold. All that wheezing and sneezing makes us weak. So in today's session, we learn about an important aspect of staying healthy. But more in the domain of what we can avoid in order to stay healthy. Can you guess what? Today's session is about disease, because if we want to stay healthy, we should avoid diseases, and to avoid them, we must first know what they are. The disease is the word made up of two parts, dis and ease, meaning a state of the body that is not at ease. When a person suffers from a disease, the person shows signs or symptoms of a body not working like it is supposed to do. When a person suffers from a disease like the common cold, the symptoms include runny nose, difficulty in breathing, constant sneezing, and even fever. So simply, disease is a state of the body when different organs are not working as they should. Diseases are caused by many things like germs and unhealthy habits. The common cold is caused by a virus called rhinovirus. These are small microscopic organisms that destroy our organs. Other diseases like cancer are caused by unhealthy habits like smoking or chewing tobacco. So, kids. It is very important that we stay clean to avoid the germs that might cause diseases, because germs can cause diseases like tuberculosis, cholera, or even polio, that are way serious than just a common cold. Also, you should maintain good habits because bad habits often causes a lot of diseases too. Like drinking alcohol can damage your liver and cause a disease called liver cirrhosis, and you might also have heard that smoking causes cancer. Not just that, eating too much sugar or fat can cause diseases like diabetes and heart diseases. That's all for today. In the next video, we will learn about the types of diseases. Until then, keep growing, keep learning. Bye bye.